Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing an eyebrow tutorial. It's been highly requested on my Instagram. I can't think how many times my followers have asked me to do one, which is incredibly flattering. Um, so I'm going to do that today for you guys. So let's just get into it. I am going to be using the Brow Wiz Pencil in Brunette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I'm also going to be using another product by her, which is the Brow Duo Powder in Medium Brown. I absolutely swear by her products. She just knows the brow like the back of her hand. I got these two at Sephora. Um, I think they might be at Ulta, but don't hold me to that. I did overpluck my eyebrows last week. I just went crazy with the tweezers. I totally regret it. But um, they are looking a little sparse and a little thin. They don't always look like this when they aren't filled in. But today I will still do the tutorial as if I had hair there. So I'm going to thicken them up a bit today. I do also use a couple other products which I will show in this video. Um, one of them is the MAC Gel Liner in Dip Down. I use that for the tail ends of my brows when I want them to have a little bit more drama and just to make them a little bit darker. I will show you that part of my eyebrow tutorial today, but I don't do it every day. So let's get started. So here are my sad brows. So taking the Brow Wiz Pencil, we are going to start from the inner part of the eyebrow, outline the bottom part. Then we are going to work our way down the tail, and then also outline the top part of the brow. Start filling in those spaces. Remember, I am thickening my brows, so I am going above my eyebrow hairline. Next, I'm taking the spoolie on the number seven brush and blending that color out and working it into the inner part of the eyebrow because we don't want that too harsh of lines. Next, taking the brush part of that same spoolie brush, dip it into the darker color of the Brow Powder Duo. Then start filling in the sparser parts of the brow, which unfortunately for me is basically the whole brow. Flipping the brush up, make short vertical strokes to create the illusion of hair. Taking the spoolie brush again, blend the color out. Let's work on the other brow. That's much better. Taking MAC Dip Down and the MAC 263 brush, I'm going to add a little more drama. Taking that darker color, work it into the outer part of the brow all the way down to the tail. Repeat on the other eye. Taking the spoolie again, blend that extra color out. And there you go.